you told them it's the best thing since sliced bread, and now you're discounting it. If it was the best thing since sliced bread, guess What's what? What's going on guys? In today's video, we're going to be talking about discounts. The premise of this video is to really break down are discounts a good thing or a bad thing. As you guys can see, I have my newborn daughter here, so please bear with the crying if there is going to be crying throughout the video. Now, with that being said, let's get back into it. What is a discount? Is a discount good or is a discount bad? If you're talking to old head car salesmen, realtors, mortgage brokers, they'll be the first to tell you that discounts are a way for salespeople to show how weak they are in their craft. I don't believe in that wholeheartedly, but I do believe a certain percentage of that is true. Now, if you talk to newer car salespeople, newer realtors, newer mortgage brokers, they'll also be the first ones to tell you the inverse, which would be you have to discount the product a little bit because the customer today wants to feel like they're getting a deal. Again, I believe partially in both sides of the story. I can tell you right now, working in sales for the last 10 years, if you've provided enough value for your customer, they won't ask for a discount. And the ones that do ask for a discount, sometimes they just wanna feel like they got a good deal. And if you can't take away an extra 500 bucks, 50 bucks, 20 bucks, whatever it may be, your margins are too low. So you probably need to reconsider what your margins look like and what success looks like for you over a long enough period of time. So going back to it, are discounts good, are discounts bad? I think discounts are okay if you use them in the right way. Now, one caveat I wanna add here as well is, if you're providing discounts to your customers the second they ask you for a discount, what are you doing? Learn how to sell your customer on value, build value for your customer before you give away your discounts. If you're saying, sure, let's give away the discount instantly, what you're doing is not giving the customer a favor, but you're devaluing the product that you have. You're devaluing everything that you worked hard for to pitch your customer on the product that you have, how great it is. You told them it's the best thing since sliced bread, and now you're discounting it. If it was the best thing since sliced bread, guess what? They would have bought it. And they do wanna buy it, but they don't believe the value that you projected to them is equivalent to what is coming out of their bank account, their credit cards, or their invoice on a monthly basis. So your job, before you discount the product, is to learn how to build so much value tied into your proposition to your customer that when they do ask for a discount, you know how to overcome that objection. And worst case scenario, if you need to give a little bit of a discount, you can do so. If you guys like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you watch these two clips right here and tag two friends below. I'll see you guys in the next one.